Hey, good mo uh, good afternoon, everybody. Today I got a real short video um, pertaining to insurance, and I want to make this video to try to uh, help people save money on insurance. Um, this may or may it may not a, a affect or pertain to everybody, but to a lot of people it will, and so. Uh, especially the new the new people that are just starting out. So let's say what I see is a lot of people when they decide that they want to do this type of work, you know, they go out and they buy their cargo van, even without having you no know, a contract or anything like that. People will still go out and buy their cargo van, and you know uh, don't really have any work set up. And so you do all the things that you're supposed to do uh, as far as getting your vehicle, getting your insurance, getting. Uh, everything else that you have to pay for but you don't have to work so what I'm going to say is something that I think that it, it could help a lot of people when it comes to saving on insurance so you know you always ask a question about what type of insurance that you should get and depending on what type of service you provide which is a question I ask when I do my consultations um, that is to determine what type of insurance you need so one of the um, the most common policies is the one million one million dollar policy of cargo insurance and for and, and i believe that's that's more of what you need when you're doing over the road you know um and again that's that's different from you doing you know medical or uh you know over over the road insurance is, is definitely going to be different from you know other subjects that you may provide so if you sign on with a company as a third party you may not be required to have the one million dollar policy and a lot of companies will tell you what you need before you sign on with them but a lot of people will go out and get the one million dollar policy before they get the information they need so for example the company you know i'm doing um i, I do work with i greenville they say that they require me to have a hundred thousand dollars worth of insurance because uh, a lot of the stuff they touch won't be any, any more than that so if I'm someone new and I went out and bought one million dollars worth of ins cargo insurance, I'm spending too much money that I don't I don't need. So they tell me I need one hundred thousand dollars of cargo insurance, and you know um, that may cost me. I I, I don't know. It'd be different for everybody, but let, let's just say it costs one hundred eighty dollars a month. You know that cargo that that one million dollar policy can cost you, you know, a thousand a month. You know, I, I know I, when I when I started off, I did that. I went and got a cargo van, and I got the insurance because that's what I always read that it was required. And sometimes, even in different states, they require different things. But you know, I like to go off, um, you know, make sure that I know what I need before I go get it. And that's what I didn't do when I started out. And so, you know, me paying eleven hundred a month for the, the one million dollar policy that I had, I was wasting money that I'm not gonna get back. And so now. I've, I've learned that let me do my research first and find out what I need before I go spend that money. So um, I put it, I made a video the other day that uh, it kind of directed you to some cargo insurance and it, and it give you a little quote where you can pay every week. Uh, someone had wrote that they, they got a, uh, a quote for $60 a month. I don't know exactly uh, the dollar amount of cargo insurance that he got, but you know, um, I suggest some of you go check it out but I just want to make this video for everybody to make sure that you know for sure what type of insurance that you need for the type of service you provide so first of all know what type of courier service you're going to be providing everybody's not going to be driving over the road so it can be different so make sure you know what service you're going to provide then um, determine what type of cargo insurance you need and so i hope this helps um i hope this help people out you know before you go out and spend that big money on insurance so um that's all i got um if you want to book a consultation i'll leave a link in the description um and whatever else i could think of at the moment will be in the description for anybody to check out um that's all i got thank you